Hello everybody, hello, hello, and thank you very much for watching my channel. This is Nighttime, not your typical old man, streaming on YouTube and Twitch from Izmir, Turkey. That's the big country right there. And the circle city is Izmir. I am from. How's everybody doing? How is everybody doing? I'm doing fantastic. Thank you very much for asking. So even though I uploaded the uh, video called uh, Iron Sight seems like uh, have like a its own cult because uh, it's not a new gamers friendly noob friendly game you know uh, game Iron Sight it's like a uh, it's like a few players just curse the game so they they won't just keep that game for themselves and a few hundred people plays that game now here's the thing what's going on with the Iron Sight very quick not very quick but I'm gonna take some. I'm gonna take my time and I'm gonna talk about this game a little more now when I play the game as you can see if you're watching me everything moves very fast enemy teams even you know my movements like you know when I run everything like it you know uh, moves very fast in front of me confuses me that's the thing and everybody in enemy team you know they're running around like even my um, teammates running around like a chicken head cut off literally running all over the place but when I watch the game on the re you know replay option it's built in the uh, game which is one of the one of the best options you know uh, features when I watch it on the replay it doesn't matter which players point of view I go and watch everything seems like normal everything moves normal shootings normal not like when I'm playing the game everything turns into normal all of a sudden that is a phenomenon, by the way. I, I couldn't find out. It's very weird. And second thing is, I've tried all the ARs, SMGs, and I'm trying to kill people. I'm emptying my magazine. They're not dying, right? However, if I pick up a weapon from a high-level player, that gun is so powerful, it kills in one or two shots. For some reason, uh, high levels, you know, good players, weapons, are a whole lot better than mine so i'm thinking is it is it because of the uh, when you go up to levels your damage you go higher of your guns is there any like a perks you earn is it pay to win i just don't know the answer i just don't know the answer my guns my weapons don't kill but when i pick up something from the floor it starts kill it starts killing that's another thing and the third thing is i, I just you know it's it's just, as i said time to kill on my end I'm hitting the head, I'm hitting the uh, body many, many times, they're not dying, and I'm getting killed with two shots. However, after I replay the game, watch this, I'm emptying my magazine, they're not dying, right? Their health is going down, but they're not dying. And I feel like they're shooting twice, and I'm dead. I'm going to that moment on the rewatch, you know, replay. I'm watching from their point of view. Their point of view is also the same. They are almost emptying their magazine they're shooting me like a, you know they're hitting me a few times i'm dying but it's not the way i'm seeing it when i'm playing it it is so weird so there are some stuff in this game is not explainable however however yesterday when i was watching one of the players looked uh, you know very pro i mean the guys nobody is nobody's moving in front of him and i say maybe the replay option maybe slows down things you know does something different right before i start the um my stream today i found a guy who tried iron sight and he says this could be a very very perfect game like a call of duty if they fix a few you know uh bugs i watched it and i want to show it to you now i'm gonna run and i'm gonna show it to you now yesterday when i when i was showing my game you know uh, the guy in my game things were things were moving slow Everybody was running, but they're not that fast. On his point of view, things were normal view. But now, what I'm going to show you, the guy is, the guy is pro. He's, a, he's an online gamer. Uh, he plays, uh, you know, it, that's what he does. He, that's his income, I think. Or he's a very, very good player. In his point of view, now you're going to see, things are moving fast too. But he is so good, he just cannot miss. He's that good. But the things is still... You know moving so you know fast again 
when I say that Ironside is is a horrible game. It's not. It's horrible game for the new starters, noobs like me. It doesn't accept the new gamers. It, it doesn't accept low level gamers. That's what I'm trying to say. That guy is a, a pro. He knows how to play. He knows how to aim and shoot. So you're gonna see now. You're gonna see now. I'm gonna show you now how he plays. But on his because of the you know it's a you know uh, it was uh, I think uh, stream his stream from his point of view while he plays he playing the game. You will see things are moving fast on his end too. It's not a replay, it's a real play. And I said, this guy is very, very good. I mean, he, sh he, he kills headshot with the pistol a few times. But he, because he's good. If I would be that good, I wouldn't complain either. But I want to show the uh, screen movements on his point of view. The subject, it was four months ago. The guy's name is Nate Gibson. Four months ago, 30,000 views, 30,000 views. It's called, this free Call of Duty could be, could, could have been so great. You see how things moving very fast? Uh, oh, I got him. You see how things moving very fast, the view? If you watch the replay of this same game, it's not, it's not like that. It slows down. Trust me. Now, this, this guy is awesome. Of course, he uses the headphones and all that stuff. He hears everybody. Oh my god, you're so pissed. He thinks the claymore is kind of bugged. I'm just gonna one everybody. Let's do this one more time. That was a chat on the middle of the uh, screen. Mm. You see, he doesn't miss because he's a good player. He he uses headphones. He's a very good player. He moves 80, 80, 80 uh, twerks, as you're supposed to do, right? Damn, I can hear that guy. Hardly miss. Away. Now that guy is a good player. But if you know, if you notice something, everything's moving very fast. What the fuck it doesn't bother him because he's a good player. Oh my god, the game didn't want me to kill that guy. My conclusion, I don't know if I, I don't know if I have a conclusion by the way. I don't think I have a conclusion for this game. Besides me not being a good player. I think I can conclude that this uh, Ironside game one is not a new gamer friendly. That's that's period. That's it. And there are uh, reasons for it. the most important reason is that it's not a you know a new new player, not a new player friendly because there there are no new players and there are no AIs when you go TDM or whatever. They're all real players, all experienced players. So that you cannot be you know uh, playing with those. Uh, whatever the reason, the movements are fast for new players and everything moves fast. TTK is very uh, late. Whatever reason. For us, the new players and noobs. But if you have an experienced player, it doesn't matter what you do. You cannot miss it because you're experienced. Another conclusion I came up with. You cannot play this game without the headphones. I play every game, including Call of Duty, without headphones. I still I still can hear on my you know, speakers. I can guess you know, uh, where the sound coming from. But because it's so fast, my reaction times are so slow as a, as a noob. I have to very... You know, uh, Fast player and fast motion and all that stuff. Because a fast moving game, Ironside game, requires headphones for you to hear. I think these two conclusions I can you know, come up with. Other than that, I have no idea what's going on. It's a very, very weird game. Super weird game. But it is, how am I going to say, underrated, underplayed. Its graphics and features is very good. That's why I keep playing it, even though I'm bashing it. And I don't know, maybe devs are hopeless. I mean, maybe they don't know how to fix any of those things. But if they did fix it, I can only imagine Iron Sight being a whole lot, you know, uh, better than even Call of Duty of all, you know, games. I'm bashing it. I'm playing it because I like the game. I wish devs can do something. And I wish somebody tells me this is the reason other than just, you know, saying that, you have to have, you know, headphones and you have to know how to play the game. Besides those, some other, you know, explanations. Maybe there are not many servers. That's why you have more delay. Maybe my location, maybe my location is doomed. Even though I connect to uh, servers, maybe it's from here to there situation. I don't know. Anyways, as I'm going to show you something very quick. This is, this is my whole desk. I have the small keyboard here so I can play the game. And I have a huge amount of space for my mouse. 
So it's not even my, you know, desk that gives me problems or anything like that. I'm ready for uh, first person shooter games. I did play first person shooter games. I keep playing it. Uh, like a Warface, like even Call of Duty in the past. Um, Battlefield 5. I have all those games. Even the, uh, what's go? Well, other first person shooter games. And this is the only one. Only one. I started uh, while I'm hating it. When I'm starting and hating it at the same time. But, you know, you like the game. You still, you know, keep playing it. There's no, there's no uh, adjustment period on this game. There's no adjustment at all. You just jump into a, you know, fast game. And I talked to some of the uh, gamers, Ironside gamers, they agree with me. This is not a toy. But because you say this is not a toy, you don't have too many players, unfortunately. And I'm not asking, you know, the toy game either. Maybe like a one thing or two things needs to be fixed, not a whole lot. Maps are good. Many maps out there. Uh, graphic is good. Futures are good. I mean, this, this game offers uh, spectating in the live events, live, you know, games. Think about it. You're a streamer, and this game is, you know, picking up. You, you, you uh, created tournaments, just like a CDL or whatever, small versions, obviously, and you connect, uh, communicating with the uh, team, something's giveaway, like a skins or whatever, and you are streaming the, uh, what you call, event. Nobody has to do it, just you do it. It's perfect. What an entertainment, what a, what a content. It doesn't make any sense. I mean, it's a gold mine. Covered with uh, stones. It's under. Nobody knows. All right. Player base. Good question. I am one of the player base, right? I am one of the player base. If I will be a, you know, diehard first person shooter gamer, whatever, like I pay money for other games, I will try this game and play only once and then leave. There are problems with it for the new players, noobs like me. I don't know what it is. That's what we can we cannot find out what it is. They say it's the uh, desync, data sync, and other things. Ironside accepts only good players. You know, you have to be really good and first-person shooter, almost like a pro level. Your aims, your shoots, your you know everything should be perfect. Like you're a card player and then trying this. Otherwise, if you're you know just like a casual player like me, I mean I cannot be like a first, second, and third. You know, often like I'm, I'm like a first on my team once a year. Not all the games though, like Call of Duty, Battle, Mo uh, Battle Prime, and other games like mobile or PC. There's a there's a warm up level. There's a adjustment level. This game doesn't have any adjustment level. That's like a new gamers come here and then just bounce from the wall and goes back. It has nothing to do with the advertisement. It has not to do with anything. A lot of people play this. A lot of you know streamers, including Shroud. You know who that is. Years ago, tried it. At the end of his uh, uh, try, he said, "I cannot play this. Good luck to you guys." That's his exact words. So what is wrong with the game? If I know, I mean, I kind of know, but you know, they, they're not gonna fix it. So it is nothing to do. It's player base needs a player base, but unfortunately, with all these games out there, it's not gonna have as much as. Uh, I wish to be and I'm saying people like me casual players even streamers whatever if I don't know why I mean look developers have like an office right they go to work they do some work in the office and then go back home whatever I don't know what they do I have no idea I don't I have no idea what these devs do okay maybe they work in other games other stuff okay nobody thinks okay look there, there are people here there are people will promote our game how it's so simple look there is a uh, there is custom match up. This this almost every game has is custom matches. But here, if you create one custom match, you can spectate it. You don't have to play. That is a gold mine for any streamer. You don't have to. You can you know bring some people together, five five whatever. Some teams have a tournament free. You can do that. There's a spectating option for this game. There's all kinds of options. Let's get our heads together. Let's fix this problem so other you know, streamers can you know, use all those features in this game, do all those tournaments, all those games and all that stuff, and promote our game. In Call of Duty, you cannot do that. Call of Duty, you don't have a spectator option. It's all official. You have to be official. All the CDL right now, Call of Duty games and stuff like that, you cannot. All the officials doing the spectating. As a streamer, I can do it. Get a five, five, 10 teams all together. 
ever one week tournament boom and i'm saying this game is this game is gold man this game is really good but they don't want it i don't know what they did they don't want it they don't want it they just don't want it or they cannot afford it or simply they, they just don't know end of story um, i'm doing my share unfortunately i have four viewers a week i cannot be you know that much uh, effective unfortunately and at the beginning of this stream i show i show a, a video from one guy played he's a very good player even he says four months ago this is if they fix a few bugs this game could be better than call of duty go watch it's not my word it's the guy who plays this game a whole lot better so it's not me it's not an old noob guy no it's the game yeah i'm not gonna play I'm not gonna even bother playing. I'm waste my time. And that's a wrap. The game actually seems pretty cool, but I'm not. Yeah. There's no way to disable Bowser Excel. That's fucking. That's a joke. All right.